Well, hello! Uh, we're here to try more uh, treats from Japan. Um, that's Dana and Shane. Uh, here's the treat box. It's still May, um, but we just decided to do, you know, a little bit each week so it lasts us the month because deliciousness. <laughs> I, I like it. It it is. There, there's also the possibility of getting some really really gross stuff. Update on the last uh, video as well. We ate. Well, he ate more of the fish stuff, and it was bad. It ended up being really really bad. Yeah, I think I mentioned it in a comment on Facebook somewhere, but yeah, it got really strong with the fish scent, and or the fish taste, and it became sort of inedible. <laughs> I, I didn't much care for it anymore. <laughs> but today, uh, we are going to try this stuff. I'm going to put the photo here. Oh, I see. Okay. Right. <laughs> so, and I think, uh, like last time, we're going to start with the drink, because both of us like drinks. That's actually one of the reasons why I got the premium box, or why I suggested getting the premium, bo premium box, because every month it comes with a drink. So, we're going to try Match My Soda. I mean, Match a Soda. <laughs> so, it's, it's a... It's a Japan, uh, she's, she's, that she's word. Shizuoka. Yeah. It's uh, 240 milliliters. It's got 35 calories per 100 milliliters, so it's not uh, it's not very calorific when you think about it. That'd be good. Maybe. Uh, let's see. All sorts of Japanese writing up here. We're just going to twist it open. It. <laughs> oh, I think it's fizzy. I heard a... Fizzy is good. Oh, there's bubbles. Oh, goody. Oh. Well, that didn't work out so well. It smells like green tea. Okay. It tastes like lightly sweetened carbonated green tea. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, it's uh, definitely green tea. And I know we did do look. We did do. Bleh, we looked up matcha last week because we weren't sure what that was. But uh, yeah. It's a kind of green tea. It's good. I think you like it. It's not too, too bad. I'd drink more of that. <laughs> All right. What's next? Banana chips. <laughs> because this guy is saying, have some chips. Have them. <laughs> Eat my chips. Okay, it's me. He's saying other exclamatory things in Japanese here that I don't understand, but this is what's going on. This is what we're having. Hey, my chips! <laughs> and you scared my cat. Good job. Go away, Eclipse. No one likes you. Aww, that's not true. That's sort of true. <laughs> this bag won't open. <laughs> well, they look just like potato chips. That's good. They smell... Cheesy? No. They smell, um... Chippy? Sort of teriyaki, actually. Oh, yeah, they do. Manly chips taste one. Mmm. It's a nice crunchy chip, like a kettle chip. Teriyaki or curry? I don't think it's curry. Mmm. There's a bit of a... Little like a little hit of a bite. Yeah, that's kind of why I said curry. Ooh. That's pretty good. Mm -hmm. I have to enjoy more of those. Mwahaha. I approve of the manly chips. They're very good. Oh, did we want to see what flavor they're supposed to be? Sure. I mean, uh. we know what flavor the matcha drink is. It's matcha flavored. Chom, 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 chom. Shut up. <laughs> So this is the uh, the booklet that tells you... Oh, it's upside down. Yeah, it um, opens like a Japanese book. Sorry. Because it's Japanese. But it tells you everything in here. So Don't you read manga? I do. Shouldn't you know? I did. Anyway, find, find yeah, what? yeah, yeah, yeah. Find manly chips. There they are. All right, so Kabuki actor Shido Nakamura's potato curry chips. Well, I'm wrong. <laughs> I was right. It's great. Rare. <laughs> Asshole. Hey, this is a family-friendly channel, please. Oh, really? <laughs> you never told me that before. Surprise! <laughs> oh, okay, well, I'll, I'll uh, keep that in check then. So they are curry chips. They are. 
Uh, this famous Japanese kabuki and Hollywood actor, Shido Nakamura, has created a very popular snack in the form of these awesome chips. The potato curry chips offer you a delicious flavor of Japanese curry spices paired with a very crisp potato chip that will leave you longing for more. Curry fans, look no further. They're good. Yeah, I like them. <sighs> so do we try log next or strange wafers next? I say log. Okay, this is the unknown flavor. Yeah. The other log had teriyaki at the top. This one has Japanese mm, phrasing. Kanji? Is that what that kanji? is? Kanji? Yeah, kanji or hiragana katakana. I think it's it's one of them. There's three different forms of writing in Japan. Shut up. Yuragama katakana. Coke yeah. banana? <laughs> no. Alright, let's see. I'm gonna open this one. This one's got a hole in it. Did the other one have a hole in it? No. I don't remember there being a hole in it. This I'm pretty sure the other one didn't have a hole it's in like it. It's like a little donut. Uh, see? It, wow. What hole? <laughs> I think it's... I can't identify the smell. Cheesy. That's what I would have guessed, like, almost like a pizza flavor. Yeah. Go ahead, just take a bite. Instead of trying to split it, it was a pain in the mm -hmm. butt to split it last time. It's a little spicy. Not bad, but a little spicy. I was not expecting. Wasabi. Hot like wasabi when I bust rhymes. Big like Leanne rhymes because I'm all about value. Brett Camford's got the mad hits. You try to match with. You try to hold me, but I bust through. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna break it, take a pick. I like a steak and egg and chicken. Like let's find the finest of flavors. No. Oh. Are you done? Can we see the show? Cause you... <laughs> yeah, I'm done. Okay. Good. Yeah, that was wasabi. Really, it tasted yeah. kind of sweet for wasabi. Uh -uh. I'll see what the Book says. Look it up. If it's if I don't remember if they're separate though. Well, there they are. Nope, that's the sour things. I don't think they're here. No, they have to be there. Nope, I see the crunky bar. Check another. They're not all. Are they all on one page? Uh, yes. Impossible. Brew. They didn't have some of the other things either. So. What? Yeah. So we got, like, mystery things? We got mystery things. We'll never know what they are. <laughs> never, ever, ever. Yeah, no, it's not here. It has failed us. This has failed us. Tokyo treat box, bag, book. Next treat. Booklet. <laughs> so this, uh, we've noticed since the last time that there's, like, there's a little, little, there's a little package, package in there. We get to see what that package is. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe. Yes. Yeah. Oh, yay! It's open. All right. Well, these feel very wafery. <laughs> well, they look very wafery. They, they kind of look like coasters. They, they do. Here, take one. All right, I'll take one. Wow, that is. Excuse me, I'm burping up matcha there. Okay. And then there's this. Oh, it's a jelly. It's um unnamed because it's got all sorts of Japanese writing that I don't understand. It looks like sakura stuff. You said that. You said that about anything pink. Oh, it's sakura. Well, well it's it's pink. It's got sakura. It's got sakura blossoms. It's gonna be I... sakura. Sakura, sakura, sakura. Sakura? You want some sakura juice? Sure, I'll have some sakura juice. I don't know how much I'm supposed to put on. I don't know either. I mean, it's a tiny, tiny thing. Okay. Eh. Well, see, I put my finger in my mouth, and it still had dust from the log. <laughs> Gross. I'm putting a little bit more. Because I'm special. Yeah, I got a little bit of that. I'm going to put it in half. I'm just going to eat it like this because it's like this already. Uh, body of Christ. I don't think that's sakura. Mm -mm. Oh. It's salty, isn't it? Yeah, it's a little, little, little salty. That's weird. Yes. Yes, it is. I was expecting something sweet because it was pink. <laughs> I was wrong. Rare. That I was wrong? That you admitted. Oh. Do you like it? I don't know. I like the wafer. The wafer is just like a plain old wafer. Yeah. yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. 
the kind of wafer that'll get stuck to your mouth. You just like, uh, uh. Yeah. <laughs> I can't get it off. I don't know. It was good. The wafer itself has a little bit of sweetness to it. Mmm. I kind of just want to try this thing on its own. It's super salty. Which is weird. Salty. Almost vinegar, not quite vinegary. You want to try it? Mm. Like, no. No, I put, a, I put a chunk on the way for that. <laughs> yeah, 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 not that it was bad, but I don't want to have it on its own. Can I look so it up? What are these things? Too far. Way for us. Plum jam crackers. I didn't taste like plum at all. Do they have different kinds of plum in Japan? Very possibly. These crispy rice snacks will surprise and delight you. Well, they surprised me. I wasn't delighted. <laughs> With a hint of real plum jam that you can spread onto the crackers to your liking, the combination can be extremely addictive. We ended up eating lots and we think you will, in you will love them too. Enjoy on the go or at home, but more importantly, enjoy. Hmm. Well, well I, I didn't mind them. I just, I, I don't see how it's plum. Like, well, we're used to the sweet plum. Yeah. And but I mean, I'm sure that there are some that are just not. I'm gonna try another one with the wafer because I can. <laughs> sure. Oh, you're trying the whole thing again. Yes. You're gonna try and see if you can identify the plum. Maybe. See if maybe there's a little bit more in there. Maybe it's plum sakura. Oh no, it's not because we read it. This is what I deal with all the time. Not all the time. A good chunk of the time. Please. Each wafer. This is the Shane and Dana, Dana and Shane taste things, not Dana and Shane argue about shit. No, that's going to happen anyway, though. <laughs> so, do you taste plum? <laughs> not really. Meh. It's not horrible. It's not as bad as the fish things. And the last thing I wanted to open was... Something that we missed last week that probably isn't food. Um, it kind of feels like a wet nap, <laughs> but I don't think it is. So let's open it up and find out. It's almost like the stickers. Well, it, it, it is a wet nap. Maybe it is a wet nap. Um, we got a picture of a guy in an egg trophy. See? Egg Ooh, trophy guy. Egg trophy. And on the back, she's a little egg king. Because right, that's, that's right. important. Um, of course it is. And this is in its own package. I bet you it's just a wet nap. Well, let us see what our lovely... It's not a wet nap. No? Oh, it, uh, maybe, is it gum? It's gum. Gum? <laughs> Why, thank you. It's like, um, remember baseball cards when they had gum with them? Oh, okay, yeah. Hmm. It's a different flavor, but it's the same texture. Mm -hmm. But it's fresher because they keep it wrapped in a little piece of plastic. Well, it's good, you know, shipping it overseas and nothing else. Yeah, but the ones we used to get were just, like, wrapped in the paper, and it's like, Oh, the gum! <laughs> oh, there goes a tooth. <laughs> Didn't need those teeth, right? Didn't need those teeth. No. So apparently this is Gudetama, Gudetama character seal and gum. So Gudetama. Not quite. So this is the lovely, lovely seal. And or, 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 or. So it's an egg seal? Well, kind of seal. So, Gudetama is a sad looking egg character that has recently become extremely popular in Japan. Alright then. Uh, in this month's boxes, enjoy a flavorful Gudetama gum paired with a character seal that you can save afterwards. The snack is beneficial for collectors of cute Japanese. Oh, good gods, I hate you so much! <laughs> And I'm gonna keep the seal. The steel doesn't stick. Well, you don't want that on your forehead? No, I don't want that on my forehead. That comes as a surprise to me. Oh, it shouldn't. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, you were saying the uh -huh. seal? The snack is beneficial for collectors of cute Japanese character items. Enjoy! Uh... And that's it. For this week. We'll see you next, next week. Time. Or next week. <laughs> Bye. Next time, next week. We still haven't figured out the outro, so Not it's cool. Yet. What's this? Oh, it's the light switch. <laughs> oh, it got super dark. Oh. Bye.
Hey, uh, one more thing I wanted to mention is that uh, next weekend, June uh, 11th, on Saturday, I'll be at Graphicon. I I'm not uh, doing anything important. I'm just volunteering. So if you want to come and say hi and, like, fanboy over me or fangirl <laughs> over me, you know, feel free. We can talk Tokyo treats or gaming or or you, we can just talk about me because I'm amazing. Yeah. yeah. Dana, Dana will be there, too, but she's just paying to get in, so. Yeah, I'm just a normal con goer. Not as cool as me at the volunteer. Nope. So, <laughs> You'll yeah. also probably be stuck in one place, most likely. Well, they, they plan on rotating me a bit, so I might be in several places, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. So, uh, yeah. If you're free, check us out. I'll put uh, the link in the show notes. Below. <laughs>